today I'll be doing a WWE Superstar tier list. Here are the categories. We have GOAT, greatest of all time. Great. Good. Meh. Bad. Trash. Whoever is in the trash category, that means he's shit. Retire, please. John Cena. You know John Cena where he's going. He's going in GOAT. He's 16 times world champion. His matches are great. WrestleMania caliber uh, superstars. He's, he's just unbelievable. He is Mr. Russell Hoyer to respect. This is not a, this is not words. This is action. This is really John Cena. I mean, his matches are great against Triple H, against Randy Orton, against AJ Styles. So that's why I put him in the greatest of all time. Michael Cole, you agree with me, right? Then you have The Undertaker. I will put The Undertaker also in GOAT. I don't need to say why. I mean, the, the man proves himself every time that he still got it. Just like we saw in the Boneyard match, he still got it. He's the American badass right now, and he's just great. Michael Cole, he's great. I mean, I'll put him in gold, but he's like great. I will not put him as the same category of John Cena and Undertaker, but he's great. Gargano, Mr. Takeover, you already know the guy, he's super good, I mean, he's Mr. Takeover, and yeah, the guy's proving himself every takeover that he is still Mr. Takeover, no matter what, Brock Lesnar, the beast incarnate, of course, GOAT of WWE, started in 2003, won the Royal Rumble, won his first WWE Championship match against The Rock in SummerSlam, he is truly the GOAT of WWE, AJ Styles, of course, he's great. He's great. I mean, he. This man is is truly phenomenal. He stand, but what he's saying, by what he's saying. I mean, his matches are great against the Undertaker, John Cena, Randy Orton. This this is just unbelievable. Seth freaking Rollins. I'll put him in great. Yeah, he's great. Seth Rollins is great too. I mean, if you think New Era Raw. What the first guy comes up? Seth Rollins, SmackDown, AJ Styles, NXT, Gargano, and Ma and uh, Adam Cole. That's why I'll put him in. Great. Alistair Black, good. He's super underrated. Super underrated. Tommaso Ciappa, good. I mean, his matches are very good. I was Adam Cole versus Gargano, but I think Gargano and Adam Cole are carrying his matches, but he's still good in the ring. And Randy Orton, I'll put him in good, in GOAT, in GOAT. This guy is still a full-timer, he's here every week, misses this week, but his matches are great against Triple H, against John Cena, against AJ Styles. He's truly the GOAT of WWE. 13 times world champion. 13 or 14? I don't know. 13 or 14 times world champion. He's great. Sheamus, I'll put him in good. He's good in the ring. So that's why I put him in good. I mean, he defeated Daniel Bryan in 18 seconds. Yeah, because of AJ Lee. But he's still good. His matches are great. Drew McIntyre, also good. He just won the, you know, the WWE Champion. Congratulations. You deserve it. You are truly the chosen one. Shinsuke Nakamura. Good. Good or great? And NXT was great. But then he fell down because of Vince. So I put him in good. Humberto Carrillo. Humberto Carrillo. I put him in meh. No, 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 not in man, in great. His matches are very good. He's carrying, he's carrying Angel Garza and Andrade to the greatness. Roman Reigns. Do I say GOAT? He did everything. Fuck it. He's the GOAT of WWE. Angel Garza, trash. Baron Corbin, bad. Yeah, th these two are the worst. I mean, don't get me wrong. Baron Corbin has great matches, but in the main roster, he's just shit. Braun Strowman, yeah, yeah, put him in man. I mean, he just won the Universal Champion. He's great, happy days. But what did he do to earn the Universal Champion? 
in 2020, not in 2016, not 2017, 2020. Cesaro. He's also man, right now. He's not doing anything. He squashed Drew Gulak at WrestleMania 36. So yeah, that's why he's ma. Andrade. Andrade is between ma and bad, but he's the United United States champion. So I'll put him in ma. So guys, that was my tier list. Hope you enjoyed the video. And please let me know in the comment what would you change? Where do you put Andrade? I want to know what you guys thought on this tier list where would you put andrade i put him in man he's the united states champion he had great matches so that's why i put him in man but and if it was the whole the history of andrade i put him in good his matches on nxt are top so guys thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and i'm out peace <laughs>